Drop the gun! Show me your hands! Immigration and Customs Enforcement announced that it had arrested 220 illegal immigrants in a nine-day enforcement operation with criminal convictions that included rape and murder. ICE apprehended 220 removable non-citizens with convictions including domestic violence, sexual abuse, burglary, gun crimes, drug trafficking, and driving under the influence. The arrests took place between March 4th and March 13th. Those arrests included a 64-year-old Mexican national convicted last year of sexual abuse of a victim under 13, a 37-year-old Mexican with a conviction for attempted murder, and a 65-year-old Mexican with convictions for second-degree murder and assault with a deadly weapon. Also arrested was a 49-year-old Mexican with convictions for battery and felony rape of a spouse by force or fear. Other illegal immigrants arrested include a 20-year-old Cuban with a conviction last year for second-degree murder, a 33-year-old Nicaraguan with a conviction of armed burglary, a 50-year-old El Salvadorian convicted of sexual abuse and sexual contact with a child under 11, and a 44-year-old Mexican convicted of sex crimes with a child under 11. ICE arrested 46,396 illegal immigrants with criminal histories last year, the agency said that those included 198,498 associated charges and convictions. In fiscal year 2020, the last full year of the Trump administration, the agency aimed to deport 151,000 convicted criminal illegal immigrants and deported just over 100,000. In fiscal year 2021, the target was 97,440 and just 39,149 were removed. By 2022, the first fiscal year of the Biden administration, the target had dropped to 91,500 and just over 38,000 had been deported. The agency has now lowered the target for fiscal years 2023 and 2024 to just 29,393 deportations each year. Border Patrol agents in the Rio Grande Valley sector had arrested four gang members and a sex offender among the migrants they encountered this week. One of the men is a 41-year-old Mexican with prior convictions for sexual abuse of a minor in Indiana. While agents in McAllen also arrested a Pisces, MS-13, and Wild Mexicans gang member from El Salvador, along with a Mexican with a prior conviction for aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and manslaughter. That came just days after Border Patrol Chief Raul Ortiz told lawmakers that the southern border is not under operational control.